Ah, oh, the presidents. Oh, I didn't see a stand in there. On this edition of Inside Look, we're going to take a look at some of the brave and sometimes controversial leaders. President's Day. Despite being labeled the first president of the United States, there are rumored to be other presidents before George Washington. You didn't know it before? Now you do. As of 2018, there have been 45 presidents of the United States. Mind-boggling, right? William Henry Harrison was the shortest serving president of the United States, serving only a month. <sighs> After hearing those groundbreaking facts, I encourage you to, you know, well, you had the day off Monday, but just think about it from now on. And uh, despite heavy rumors, Arnold Schwarzenegger can never be president of the United States because he wasn't born in the United States. You know, stuff like that used to be really simple, but it's 2018 now, and, ah, oh well. Good morning, Baldwin. My name is Fiona Selden, and I am here with Michaela Davik, Michael Sarzinski, and Ali Dalmas. Today is Thursday, February 22nd, and here are your morning announcements. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for the rest of today's announcements. The impossible question is, there will be three new mystery flavors of this product this year. What is it? Any senior who is African American and will be attending Cheney University in the fall of 2018 should see Mr. Hall for a scholarship opportunity. The Need Scholarship Program has a full tuition scholarship which includes room and board for Cheney University. The application is due February 25th, 2018, so hurry up if this scholarship might apply to you. Penn State Greater Allegheny Campus is offering a new associate degree program in surveying engineering technology. Seniors who are interested in learning more about this program or the other associate degree programs in business, criminal justice, or information science and technology are able to attend an open house tomorrow. Transportation will be provided to and from the high school and PSUGA. Sign up in the counseling office by today. Now over to Allie for the weather. Allie? Thanks, Fiona. Today we have a high of 41 and a low of 39 and a rain percentage of 100%. We're supposed to get over two inches of rain in the next three days. Make sure that on your way home you grab a paddle and a life preserver. Now back over to Michaela for more announcements. March 12th Baldwin Talent Show. Auditions will be scheduled for next Monday and Tuesday, February 26th and 27th. See Dr. Harold, Ms. Bardis, or Ms. Duncan with any questions. Now, over to Michael for the sports announcement. Thanks, Michaela. For Olympic news, after a 20-year rivalry, women's U.S. hockey team beat Canada and won gold. Let's take a look. Last Winter Olympics, U.S. lost against Canada eight minutes into overtime. The men's hockey team had a quick and better ending this year, barely making it into quarterfinals against Slovakia. Now for local sports. The Penguins have a game against the Carolina Hurricanes. Now back to, over to Fiona for the rest of the announcements. Thanks, Michael. Today's lunch is fish taco wrap with your choice of milk. Today's weird holiday is Be Humble Day. And the answer to the impossible question of, there will be three new mystery flavors of this product this year, is Peeps. Today's Black History Month recognition is Barbara Jordan and Addie L. Wyatt, first African American women named as Time Magazine's Person of the Year. That's all for the morning announcements. Have a great day, Baldwin.